I'm hallucinating! What did you see this time? I saw Mattis with the Prince of Darkness, and they... Wait a second. Are those voices? There really is somebody on the porch. You stay here. I'll go have a look. I think the two of them would make a nice couple. I could well imagine a future for them. Your daughter, my son? Ha! One would have to recondition her thoroughly. Edna lacks all respect and is full of defiance. But aren't you on the verge of a breakthrough in the field of... What do you call it? Correction of character. That's exactly what your daughter needs. After one of those treatments, there might still be a way she could... Oh, um, could you excuse me for a moment? What's this all about, Edna? You know full well you're supposed to be in your room. I know, but... No buts. The doctor is right. You're in serious need of a correction of character. Please don't, Dad. I don't want to... We'll speak about this later. Right now, you go back to your room. I'm pretty mad at you, young lady. And by the way, try being nicer to Alfred, will you? Nicer to Alfred? <laughs> Don't make me laugh! Shut up, Harvey. It's your fault, after all. What were all those lies supposed to mean anyway? I've been thinking it over. And basically, it's pretty simple. It's not my fault at all. I'm just a figment of your imagination, remember? So why wonder if I'm a little... Well, inaccurate every once in a while. Especially when it comes to observations you couldn't possibly have made yourself. Inaccurate is something different to completely and utterly absurd. Are you mad at me now? Oh, Harvey, I can't be mad at you. aren't you? I read your diary. Harvey this and Harvey that, and Alfred is always the stupid toad, isn't he? But that will soon stop. I'll tell it all to my dad and they'll take that stupid rabbit away from you. They might even lock you up in Dad's asylum with the other loonies. That's where you belong in my book. Edna talks to her ragdoll rabbit! Edna talks to her ragdoll rabbit! Please, Alfred, don't! Help me, Edna! He's hurting me! What'll I do? Push him! What? Push him! Just push him! Push him down the stairs! Oh no. Now I can remember everything. It was me who killed Alfred. It... it was in the heat of the moment. I couldn't let him take Harvey away from me. Yes, it was you. You killed my son. Your father took the blame to protect you. I promised him that I would take care of you. But I only saw one way of doing that. I tried to create you anew, like a blank sheet of paper on which to start a new story, to erase all your tomfoolery. I nearly succeeded on many occasions, but you always found a way back to your memories. It's only now that I understand the root of the problem. Your ragdoll rabbit, Harvey, he is the anchor that moors you to the past. If you destroy him, you can finally live in peace without guilt. Don't listen to 
him, he'll destroy everything that is you! All your creativity! All that fun! Look, he's standing in the exact same spot his son was! Just a little push, and we'll be free at last! He's the only one who knows of our guilt! Oh no... What will I do? Stop. 